So I want to tell you the story on why I started this podcast. Okay, there was a prophetess that came to me. And she said, you, you have a level of influence and, and you have a following, but you're doing nothing with it. You're, you're being unfaithful with the talent that God has given you and it's time to multiply it. And it's time for you to proclaim the power of Pentecost to the world. Okay, and what God is doing in the earth and to tell people of the Great Commission and the, and the power of the Spirit and what the gospel is. And so th she came out of this and, and we were, so I said, well, what do I do? And, you know, because I didn't even know what to do with this. I, this used to be a Zusa report and just different stuff. And I said, okay, what is it? And as I was praying, and the Lord dropped in my spirit the words of this book, old book, this is the, from the pastor, it's now Dr. John Kirkpatrick, he recently got his doctrine, but Feast of Fire, this was the book about his story from his perspective of the Brownsville Revival. So, you know, when I said, okay, I have influence to do it, but it was one word. That shifted things. One word changes things. You know, I'm thinking about it in Korea, 1953. Uh, one miracle. A witch doctor's uh, daughter. She gets healed. Revival breaks loose across Korea. Like, in real. Okay? 1958 in Korea. One man gets saved. David Young Yi Cho. Largest church in the world. Again, one miracle. One word from God changed a nation. One word changes everything. And so that, that's kind of how this got started, was a prophetess came to me and rebuked me. For whatever reason, when prophets come to me, they don't tell me how great and amazing I am and how buildings and million dollars and this and that. I don't get those words. I get the, you're screwing up and you need to get your act together type prophecies. So... One word, what it is kind of how this all began. And it, that's kind of what I wanted to bring is all you need, you don't need seven dreams and 24 visions and 180 angels to show up and call it confirmation. All you need is one word from God. Test it and know it, discern it, and act on it. And everything changes. God bless you. See ya.